Hi everyone, Dr. Doolittle here. Yes, I sound like a frog. It's one of my favorite animals because I have a little thing that goes on with my father-in-law about frogs. And yes, I sound like a frog. What happened was I told some people that I fell on Monday into a car and stuff and I went to the doctor to wasn't anything about this and they gave me a flu shot. And usually when I get a flu shot, I'm sorry, I look terrible, but they usually give me a flu shot and I feel kind of icky, you know, just tired and kind of funky after I have a flu shot. Some people get a flu shot and they don't feel anything at all, doesn't affect them at all. I usually just feel icky. Well, apparently this flu shot, I think, has given me the flu. I haven't had the flu in over 10 or 15 years. I just usually feel kind of tired the next day and then I'm fine. Well, Monday I was feeling just kind of tired and sore from falling into the, the car next to our car. Then Tuesday we had rain and stuff and my neuropathy messed up so I was all sore and stuff because of the rain and falling into the car and turned out besides cutting up my elbow and um, it's still kind of, let's see if I can show you, it's still kind of messed up. And um, and then I was sore, and I have a bruise on my left side somewhere, but I'm not going to show you that because it's in a place you can't see. And then I was just really tired and worn out on Tuesday. And then Wednesday, I woke up, and I had a sore throat, but I feared, well, it would just go away, and I'd be okay. By Wednesday night, I was dizzy and shivering and, like, freezing to death, and... I thought I thought I was like going to die. I was like crazy cold and hot and everything else and I went to bed. And when I woke up Thursday morning, I threw up 5 times. When I first woke up and went to the bathroom, I threw up. And it was just like water. And then I took my pills and thank God I didn't throw my pills. But I have to take medicine every day. Like 10 or 15 minutes after I took my pills, I threw up water again. And then I thought, well, maybe I take some Pepto Bismol to settle my stomach. And we have chubble Pepto Bismol. <coughs> and it tastes funky, so I always drink a little water after I do that. Well, 15, 20 minutes after I took the Pepto Bismol, I threw up a bunch of pink junk. And then, oh, a couple hours later, I threw up what looked to be what I'd ate the night before, which was macaroni and cheese. And then later in the day, I threw up some more water and some stuff. I didn't eat all day Thursday. I had thrown up like a total of five times. And at first, my blood sugar was really high. It was like 300 and something. And then it just kept going down finally. And it was 83 last night, and it was 83 this morning. And between Monday and this morning, I've lost three pounds, which I don't mind losing the three pounds. But my nose is all stuffed up. And my throat isn't really sore, but I can't talk, and I'm coughing a little bit. So it's just mostly kind of in my throat and my sinuses right now. And I still ache, and I'm really cold, and I shiver on the inside, and I'm hot on the outside, and my head feels like it's going to bust open. Terry got some NyQuil medicine from the store, and I took some last night, and it knocked me out. And I slept till about 11.30 this morning. And so that thing, it just knocked me out. Well, I'd woke up a couple of times, and then I took some at 4 o'clock and slept till 11.30. So your little Dr. Doolittle is sick and could use some prayers because she's just not feeling good. And Dr. Merlin has been trying to take care of her and Nurse Rosebud, but she could use some prayers from all her friends out there. And I sound like a frog. I get like this every time I'm sick. I sound like a frog. Ribbit. <laughs> but I love you guys. And yes, I can laugh about the fact that I'm sick. Because it's kind of funny the way I sound. But I will talk to you hopefully when I'm better. And that's why I haven't been on here in a while. And I love you guys. And I'll talk to you soon. And I hope you all have a great weekend. I will be trying to recuperate. Bye.